Konnichiwa and I can the knife bag again here and today I am going to do a favorite video and I have done like little f um, favorite video in the pack with Dr. Charlie the guy that he helped me come up with the idea well he suggested to me the idea that I should do a video so credit to him uh, so yeah so the favorite is the the doctor's mother in the ta in the last episode of Doctor Who it was a town oh no end of time that's it boom memory um, so yeah, so in the Doctor Who, like, we, we see, like, a lot of things like, in, in Doctor Who, we, like, the Doctor, we know, in history, like, uh, the origins, as far as we know, because we haven't been given that much about history of the doc of the Doctor. We're given hints every here, there, and everywhere, every now and again, um, you know what I mean? So we, we got an understanding of the origin of the Doctor, how he, how he came to be. I know that, so like pretty much how it pretty much starts off with Dalek's invaded Gallifrey and the Doctor ran away in the TARDIS. He, he got away from there with his granddaughter. And that's how it, that's pretty much Doctor Who and how it starts. That's when it's, oh, the first episode of Doctor Who, it was something with Child, I think, in it. Um, but like, um, but obviously, so that's when it takes place. So like, obviously, like, we haven't had much of Do the Doctor Who Doctor's um, past. We have had it with, a, I think it was an episode with Max Smith, like, where I think the Doctor's crying, and I think someone was on the back. I can't remember, so I'm not going to go into it, because if I don't remember it, I don't want to sound like an idiot. <laughs> Probably already do, but anyway, anyway, back, back to the point, the Doctor's mother, like, so as we can tell in End of Time Part 2, like, th there's this woman who was helping out the Donna's father, I forgot his name, but she was helping him out, like, with, like, hints and that, whatever. I, I can't really remember. It's like, I should have really watched the episode before doing this, so I apologise for that. Um, so, yeah, so, obviously, she's, like, talking to him and helping guide him, whatever. And anyway, and then, it's the final moment of her. It's, like, in the last moment we see of her and the Doctor. It's the look they give. Now, it, that could be a mother's look. Uh, like, I think, as I say, it could be the Doctor's mother. It could it could be a former a former love interest from the doctor. Who knows? It could have been the mother of Susan. We don't know because even though she might look like a mother, but as we know, time laws they regenerate and obviously they look different every time. Um, so it could be an old doctor's love thing. But I really think it's more to do with the doctor's mother side because I won't believe that more. But that one is very possible as well. Both are, um, but. I feel because it looked more, look more like a mother's look to her son, a long lost son who ran away from home to get away from all the shit what's happening. So he decided to run away and build up a new life. And like Doctor Who always had given us different characters and aspects, even bringing back old ones um, like they did in the 50th anniversary with most, um, what's it called, characters the Doctor bumped into, like Harriet Jones. Like, she she came every now and again and she got killed in the, not in time, no, 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 it was, oh, the fish around the fish, sorry, uh, my memory's going kind of bad, so I, I apologise for that. Anyway, so, like I say, like, it, theory can't, like, it's just a theory and I really enjoy it and I want to do more theory videos in the future and I want to see more of Doctor, the Doctor's Daughter. She came, she only in that one episode. That one episode and I always wanted her to return and I still do like it's still possible for her to return to Doctor Who so I hope they do bring her back and also like we want I want to see Susan back so his other his not other daughter I mean granddaughter I'm sorry I forgot um but yeah it would be great to have the Doctor's daughter and granddaughter and say his mother all in the same like a time war family because the Doctor has had children like in the past that's why the cut when it was Max Smith. So like he had it ready for Amy because obviously the Doctor was a baby once and he had his own child. What it could be the yeah the, did I say oh I know I said love interest and mother. Who knows it could be the Doctor's daughter like um the one who gave birth to Susan. Oh yeah yeah that's love interest. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 that's not love interest. No, oh, my days. Oh, I confused myself. I'm so sorry, guys. No, but what if that is the Doctor's daughter? 
and she's looking at a, her father, who she hasn't seen in centuries, and she's looking at him again, obviously the Lords know with each other, which pretty much Time Lords are because it was when the Master returned with John Sim, my favourite Master by the way, um, so yeah, and what if that was a doctor's daughter, the one he gave birth to Susan, it would be a really nice uh, thing for that, but I really would prefer it not to be the Doctor's mother, but like, three possibilities, it's the Doctor's mother, Doctor's daughter, or former loving child, like, that's what I believe, um, you guys think of anything else if you watch Doctor, I don't know if many of my fans do watch Doctor, but if you do, I hope you enjoy uh, fear videos, and I want to do more fear videos in the future of other things, say like Supernatural or in other aspects of things, like even Overwatch, I, I thought of a fear in Overwatch, um, I might do a video on that, um, but I'm not going to go into much uh, about Overwatch because this is your Doctor Who favorite video, and I'm going to leave it here, like so. Um, I think it is the Doctor's mother, so I'll say good night and farewell, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.